All right, fire mechanic here, and today we are working on a Honda with an ABS light. Uh, and as you can see, we have a couple codes here. I'll get this to focus. Um, for the front left wheel speed sensor circuit open, front left wheel speed sensor failure, and front left wheel speed sensor wave blink or magnetic encoder diagnostic. So um, what I wanted to show you guys is a couple quick checks you can make if you have an ABS um, sensor problem or ABS light on in your Honda. On this particular Civic, I believe this is an 05. Oh, uh, let's see. Yeah, 06, 06 on his Civic. Uh, left front wheel speed sensor. So I came out to the sensor here. And one thing you can do is, I got the wheel off already. This is actually where the sensor goes into the hub. Um, you can pull the sensor out, inspect it to make sure there's no damage, and also clean this um, mounting area. As you can see here, it's pretty rusty. Um, if we pull that sensor out and try and clean that surface area and stick it back in, um, we can see if that helps. Also, this sensor is the same as the passenger side sensor. So you can actually take these sensors out and swap them from side to side to see if the light goes out. Um, you also want to check your wheel bearing, make sure your wheel bearing is tight with the wheel on, just shake the wheel side to side, make sure the wheel bearing is good and tight. But I actually, um, even though this one is setting an open, open circuit code, uh, yeah, we do have an open circuit code. Even though I set an open circuit code, that's not really relevant because uh, I actually went into the data here and I was able to spin I was actually able to spin this left front wheel and get a good uh, wheel speed signal. So that is, so the circuit is actually not open right now. So it's just picking up a false reading or no reading at all. The customer was also complaining of this, um, the, pre the ABS coming on premature. So you could feel the ABS activate in the brake pedal. You would get kind of a buzzing. So um, probably what we're going to do here is pull that sensor out. We're going to clean the, um, the rust off of it. And... If that doesn't take care of it, we're going to swap the sensor from side to side and see if the problem goes over to the right side. If it does, then we're going to go ahead and order a new sensor. But in this case, I actually think cleaning up that rust underneath the sensor is going to probably do the trick because this, because um, it looks pretty rusty under there. So just a quick, easy thing you can try if you have an ABS light on. I know this also works on a lot of the GM vehicles too. And the front wheel bearings will get rust build up underneath the sensor. And if you um, clean that rust away, and reinstall the sensor, drive it. A lot of times it'll take care of that problem. So just want to do a quick video on um, a couple easy tests you can do or checks you can do to um, see what it's going to take to fix your ABS light. Thanks for watching uh, The Flyway Mechanic. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the thumbs up button.